we've been friends for a million years, and he's a wonderful guy, well deserved. He has a wonderful son, and uh, we kind of share a lot of good things together, and some, a few headaches together. But uh, I, I think right now I'm really proud of Cal, and, uh, and uh, I think this is well past due. You've always been ethical, loyal, and hardworking. I guess that's the ingredients of your success. Again, Cal, Ben, the family, congratulations. It's well deserved and more years to come. Um, I can't think of a, a family and a business that's more deserving of uh, the Pinnacle Award. Um, you know, it's not only what you've done in your store, but what you do in the community. Cal and Ben, just want to say congratulations on your Pinnacle Award. It's uh, my honor of being here to see you receive this award. Uh, it's been a pleasure for me to serve your account for 30-some years, 32 years to be exact. Um, just enjoyed you guys as a family, as a friend, as a vendor. Congratulations. And focusing on that brand as a significant point of difference versus their competition. So much so that their brand is recognized by the Guinness Book of World Records. Wow. Fligners, congratulations. Hi, my name's Bob Montague and I worked for Mr. Fligner for 36 years in this store. And I have to say it was the greatest experience of my life. I just want to congratulate Cal and Ben. You guys are amazing. We love watching this store grow. Ben, Cal, BK, and the entire team out here, congratulations. Um, I'm a part of the Great Lakes Smoke Meats team, and I would like to congratulate the Fligner family. I am very proud of you and very proud to be a part of your team. Well, Great Lakes Smoke Meats evolved five years ago. And we do a big deli business here, and we liked having the snack sticks to sell in the deli, but we could never find anything that we really liked. But through a lot of trial and error, we felt we developed one of the top snack sticks in the United States. And based on our sales, we're growing rapidly right now. I'm hoping to have a snack stick in every refrigerator in America. I just want to congratulate the Fligner family for the award that they received from Ohio. Uh, long time coming. Uh, the store has been here for 90 years, and uh, they deserve it a lot sooner than that. But in the days of these big box stores, it's really a high honor for this company, this family, to get this award. Congratulations, Ben and Cal. I've been coming here for 57 years, and the quality has not changed. I'll go around the bigger store to come back here. When I was younger, everything was with a price gun. I learned how to take a pricing gun and price cans and groceries. And then when prices would change, you have to go back out and take the stickers off and reprice them. The one thing that hasn't changed is the customer service. We, we feel that's our greatest attribute is the fact that we know our customers when they come in. We know what our customers are looking for. We're able to cater to their needs on a regular basis. We'd like to congratulate Ben and Cal on their award. I think they did a wonderful job. Great job done. Don't worry, guys. We hold the fort over here while you're having fun at the gala. And I know some will say it's for the amazing bakery. We're the largest custom, count, custom cut full service meat counter. Or others may say it's because of your amazing assortment of specialty and international items. But I think the reason we're here today is because the people are truly the difference that work here. Congratulations on reaching the pinnacle in Ohio's grocery industry. On behalf of the association, the board of directors, and everyone gathered here, I hope you will accept this award. And we are so proud to give it to you. Thank you. I think that's great. I never expected something like this. It's really nice. Well, it's really a family. It's really our family, not any one person. It's the one, you know, it's the family. That's, that's the way I like to think of it as a family, family operation. That's got two boys too that are coming up, you know. Got to keep it all in the family. Hopefully our legacy will be in another 15, 20 years. You guys are back here and my two younger sons are standing here in front talking about the same thing. That's what we like our legacy to be.